So what if you have a court date in Linwood Municipal Court? What do you need to know about Linwood Municipal Court? If you've not been there before, it can be pretty scary to go to court. Well, my name is Lance Freyrier, and I'm the owner of the law offices of Lance Freyrier. We're a criminal defense firm located in Linwood, Washington, about one block from Linwood Municipal Court. We've been defending people charged with crimes for more than 20 years. I thought I'd make this video because so many people are nervous to go to court and I'd give you some information about what you need to know if you have a court date in Linwood Municipal Court. So first of all, where's the court located? Uh, the address is here on the screen, but basically it's at the corner of 44th Avenue West and 194th. And it's in the police station, the, the Linwood Justice Center basically. Um, the courthouse is not on the first floor of the building, it's on the second floor of the building. And when you enter the building, just go on up to the second floor, there's only one courtroom and you're gonna have to go through security. They're usually gonna lock the courtroom door on the second floor until it's time for court. So don't worry if it's, it's locked. And if you're not sure if you're in the right place, they usually keep a list on the wall that would have your name on it. Uh, nowadays, when I'm filming this in October of 2020, they're doing both video court uh, and in-person court. You can generally do it either way. They're doing video court because of COVID-19. So what type of cases does Linwood Municipal Court hear? Well, they hear non-felony crimes, things like DUI and theft and domestic violence assault. And they also hear traffic tickets. They don't do name changes, they don't do felonies, uh, they don't do sex crimes, things like that. They handle non-felony crimes and traffic tickets that happen within the city limits of Linwood. So who is the prosecutor in Linwood Municipal Court? Well, currently the prosecutor is a very fair group of people. They, they're called Zachar and Thomas, and they prosecute many different jurisdictions throughout Washington State. They're a law firm. Um, I'm going to give you phone numbers and names of all the relevant uh, people uh, later on in the video, uh, as I don't want to go over them all here and they're tough to remember. Um, but basically, Zachary and Thomas is the prosecutor. Um, and the prosecutor is the person who, who sort of is against you in the case and, and, and tries to uh, figure out how the case should be handled. You know, they may try to put you in jail. They may offer you alternatives, but they're uh, very important people in your case. Um, if you don't have a private attorney like us, you might apply for the public defender. The public defender in Linwood is called Felman and Lee. And they've been doing public defense for a long time. I was actually the prosecutor in Linwood for seven years, so I used to have to fight against Felman and Lee. But the Felman and Lee public defender's office is right next to the courthouse on 44th across from the library. And you should follow the court's instructions about how to apply for a public defender. Some other important people to know in Linwood there is a victim services advocate or a domestic violence advocate. Currently, that advocate is uh, Tiffany Cruzy, and her information will be here as well. Um, so if you're a victim of uh, domestic violence, you're the victim of the case, you want to explain what happened, you want to clarify what happened, you want to know what's going to happen in court, um, you might want to reach out to the victim's advocate. Linwood, it also has a probation department. There's two probation officers. Uh, they're there to help you should you end up on probation. Uh, they're very trustworthy. Uh, we do like working with them. And uh, those are the main players in Linwood. So what's, what are some uh, unusual uh, points about Linwood Court you'd want to know? Well, if you have a private attorney, they have their own private attorney calendar, usually Tuesdays at 10 in the morning. If you have a public defender, they typically have a public defender calendar later on in the day. Uh, if you need an interpreter, there's usually a special calendar with all interpreter cases, which is uh, very helpful. Um, and there's lots of different dispositions available or ways to resolve a case in Linwood that don't exist in other places. Uh, the first thing I can think of is called a stipulated order of continuance. Some courts, including Linwood, allow the prosecutor to offer a defendant and you might be a defendant if you're watching this, a contract, an agreement to continue the case without any findings. And if the defendant does certain things, affirmative actions like classes, and avoids certain things like new crimes, then there might be a more favorable outcome for the defendant. And you should talk to your attorney about that, but that's a really good thing about Linwood. Another good thing about Linwood is that 
they have a very efficient electronic home monitoring system. So let's say you do get convicted of a crime. In most courts, you have to go to jail. Sometimes in Linwood, you can ask for electronic home monitoring and the Linwood police run that program. And if you get granted electronic home monitoring, you can go to work, you can go to treatment, you can go to school. Uh, basically, you're at home, except when you're doing things like work and you want to keep your job. So um, lots of good things about Linwood. It's still a very serious court. You don't want to violate probation in Linwood. They have a very strong reputation for uh, being difficult on uh, probation violations. So if you have a review hearing, those are typically Mondays at one. Make sure to get an attorney. So I hope you found this helpful. Uh, that's some information about Linwood Municipal Court. I know I mentioned we'd list some names and numbers here. And so this is the spot where, where we're going to do that. So I hope you find that helpful. If you have a charge, a criminal charge in Linwood Municipal Court, feel free to reach out to our firm. We're just down the block. Again, I've I and my firm have been defending crimes in Linwood for over 20 years, and I was a prosecutor there seven years before that, so we sort of know how it works. Give us a call. We'll do everything we can to help you. We'll be there for you. Thank you.